Hello, my name is Rishab, and this is a Lego Grand Piano. It has 3,662 pieces, and this is the instruction manual. It has 550 pages and 840 steps. And it's also 18 plus. This is the stool. If you turn this up, the stool goes up. If you turn it down, the stool goes down. Same thing for the other knob over here. Now for the piano. You can open this, and then if you want, you can close it. And if you want, you can remove the sheet music. And get the stones, and then you can close this. Or you can just remove this. It is how it looks like this. But then, if you want to open it and actually put the stone for the music on, you can reattach it. And then, open it again. You can also open this up. You can see the keys. And if you want, you can go into the Lego, at one of the apps Lego produces, and go into Grand Piano. If you want, you can do play, which is you press on it, sign, and you play. And then you then you can do it all by pressing the same key. And if you want, you can go and tell listen. Let, press any song you want. Like, for example, uh, Windmung by Friends List. Press play. And the keys move by themselves. And you can hear the song on the phone. And you can pause it whenever you want. It also comes with this sheet music piece. The sheet music, uh, the song is called Play Day by Donnie Chen. There's a note for it on listen. So if you press this and go into listen again, choose from the song. There is Play Day by Donnie Chen is number one. And press play. Surprisingly, they actually managed to print the sheet music on the piece accurately. Like, 
the, the spaces from the nuts are accurate. And, but, and actually the nuts are accurate too. Cool. And, you can also, you can also add any pieces you want onto the back, but you don't do that.